What's up guys? I'm going to make a video today here showing you how to start your Basin Rover in Magnet Field. Um, I spent a little more time in this and I'm starting to like the program. I just, so I'm still, still getting accustomed to it. So if you see me stumble a little bit, you can make fun of me, but let's see if I can get a couple guys helped out here. So uh, I'm in Magnet Field. This is our home screen here. Over here next to me, I got some Sokia GRX3s sitting here. Basically, the first thing I did is I went into set up nope they already messed up configure survey and in here i created a gnss configuration so there's select from library you have a lot of different options i'm just doing rtk so i went through here and there's a couple good videos out there on youtube that show a little more detailed steps on how to go through all this it's pretty intuitive it's pretty simple basically just setting up all your options for your receivers so that's the first thing you gotta do is have a this be kind of considerable or comparable a little bit to like a uh, uh an equipment setup in pocket 3d um there's a lot more in here uh one thing i found is you know you can figure your radios in here for your receivers um but there's no and if somebody knows a way to check frequencies that the receivers are set at let me know i went through true is how I ended up doing it, but uh, so got to set this up first. Pretty easy, like I said. All other other good videos out there. I'm not going to cover that in this. Um, so to get going here, we're gonna first thing we're doing is connect. So you can see in here, I've got my GRX3 selected. I'm gonna connect to my base first. You can do connect the last Bluetooth device. Um, it'll basically automatically connect, and then. This prompt for connection at startup, basically when you first launch Magnet, it'll pop up this connection screen because it's assuming that you want to connect before you do anything. I turned off the last Bluetooth just because I like to choose which one because, I don't know, I'm just that's what I like to do. So I'm going to connect my base. It's going to search Bluetooth here. Make sure, yep, still on. Okay, so I got rover, got base. I'll select my base, hit OK. We have device info. We don't have a pen or anything. Just gonna hit connect. So attempting access. Okay, so we connect to. You'll see up in the corner here that we'll get our little receiver. It'll make some goofy noise. So now I can go into setup and go to start base. And this is just a, this is just a bogus job, but. If we had a localization in here, whatever we're using, we can select from a map, from a list. We can put our antenna height in here. We can do all that kind of stuff. And then down here, we would hit start base. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. It's gonna give me the error because I'm just sitting inside my office. Makes a funny noise, makes fun of me. So that once you do that, it'll start the base. It'll stay base started successfully and then it'll kick you over to your rover connection. Um, for rover connection, same process, really simple. It, if When it kicks you back over, it'll basically have you in the screen, and I think it automatically switches over to the rover and disconnects you from your base. But if it doesn't, it's just simple as connecting to the rover. Same process. It's going to find it. Rover, select, connect, attempting access, and then the same thing you'll see up here. And uh, yeah, configure radio. Um, oh, okay, so this is cool. So I was using a set of old receivers yesterday when I was doing this. I uh, didn't have the ability to see this channel. I had to go through true, um, but newer receivers here. Looks like I can get my, my channel and my modulation and everything right here. So I think simple as setting my configuration, start radio, and away we go. So pretty quick, simple run through, but hopefully that helps somebody if they're getting stuck, getting their base of the rover started up in Magnet. Uh, let me go if you guys got any questions or want to see anything different. Thanks.